Hey guys, it's Jason with Any Creative here for part two of adding a custom font to your Squarespace website. In this video, we're going to talk about how to apply the custom font that we added in video one to an element on your Squarespace website. If you haven't had an opportunity to watch uh, the first video, I definitely encourage you to do so. It'll make it a little bit easier for you to follow along as we move through this tutorial. Uh, nevertheless, uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, begin to apply the custom font that we added uh, on our Squarespace website. And so we'll begin by applying the custom font to the title um, on this particular page. And the way that we do that is we go ahead, uh, we right click and we inspect element. In this case, I'm using the Chrome browser, um, but it should also be available in Firefox as well. If you're using that, that's okay. And so you'll go ahead and um, inspect element, which will open up your developer tools. Uh, and with that, we need to find the specific element that we want to use to apply the custom font to. Uh, in this case, the one that we want to use is this one here. Uh, and so we're going to go ahead and copy and paste that into our uh, Squarespace custom CSS editor, um, just like so. Uh, then we're going to go ahead and open up uh, that particular element so that we can apply the custom font. Um, you can either copy and paste it or type it in however you'd like. Um, but you would take essentially the first initial code that we added uh, when adding the custom font and you're going to copy and paste that uh, to the element uh, that we're targeting. And in this case, you can see that that change has already been made uh, once we, I just did that. And so you should be able to make those changes uh, throughout your website um, and uh, throughout different elements on your website. Something to consider though is as you are uh, making these changes uh, and adding these custom fonts, uh, unless you're targeting a specific page or specific text within an element, uh, any changes that you make to generic P tags or H1, uh, H2, or H3 tags uh, on your Squarespace website are going to take effect throughout the entire website. And so just be mindful of that as you're applying your custom text uh, via the custom CSS editor. Um, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I hope you guys tune in uh, for the next video.